Hey, what's up guys? Thank you for watching another of my videos. I really appreciate it. What we're going to talk today about, it's a review. I'm a big anime guy. And as you guys can see, anime is taken all over the world. There's a new anime. First episode is out. I don't know when I'm going to do this video. Maybe, well, I don't know when I'm going to let this video into the world. I don't know if episode two is going to be out. I'm waiting. It's Monday. October 17, I was hoping the video was out already. I'm, I mean, the second episode. But this is this anime called Chainsaw Man that uh, I watched the first episode. I didn't have any hopes. I saw a lot of cosplay in Miro Comic Con. I've seen a lot of like internet stuff about it in the sense that photos, images of the manga and different things happening but never really paid attention. So I was like, let me see what this is about. Tune in into the first episode, expecting nothing. And I do have to say before I move on, the first episode had me, I need more. So with this said, uh, we're gonna go into that with it. With it. I'm a big anime like that. Guy, like I said before, so I like big stories, confusing stories, a lot, a lot of, I like a lot of detail on my stories, action. So there's a couple things, action, story, that makes sense. And then I love an anime, as I can see with this uh, Chainsaw Man. First episode, things happening, you really don't understand. As you progress into the episode, they're explaining what's happening, why it's happening how it's happening on uh, different steps and you're like okay i understand a part of this character's life that's really great i am a hundred percent with that because it hooks you other animates you watch and you don't know what's happening in the first episode you're like what's happening no this one it gives you the basics of the character's main story you understand they give you a little bit not too much and that's perfect because then they don't spoil the future towards that they give you a little bit of the backstory they give you action it builds up uh, then they do other parts explaining in the situation what the character is going through what the character is going through nothing too crazy just like oh okay i understand they hook it then they go into the next phase, the main event that is gonna have, is gonna change the rest of that character's life and is gonna make him become Chainsaw Man. I'm not running anything, I hope. So this event, you see it, I didn't expect it to happen that quick. I thought it was gonna take two, three episodes to build up, to have that happen. That, that I'm not a lot of you know what it is, so. That happened, and I was like, whoa, this quick, right? And a lot of animes, they take a little long. It's just, uh, it progresses before the big event changes this character or on this character's future. So I like the character. I have to say it's very, it's a cool guy. Um, you'll see what I mean. Once you start watching it, like, oh, okay. So this event happens, leads up to a crazy action pack. A couple minutes that you're like, oh, okay, now I understand why it was the hype of it. Perfect, great. Hook, action, great. And towards the end, something happens and you see a whole change in that whole perspective of that manga. It's like, oh, okay. In the sense, I don't, I don't know how to say it without spawning anything so in the sense that i thought it was gonna be just the main character for a couple episodes and he meet new people no it just went straight into meeting another group of people and i was like not expecting that because of the beginning of it however i have to say this anime was good i'm not gonna lie it was well first episode it hooked me it had everything i was looking for from uh anime it had it he had everything I was looking for from an anime, a story, a hook, uh, action. Um, it's just gonna build up, I'm hoping. 
I'm hoping it doesn't happen with other animes that they give you a really good beginning and then they go all over the place. This feels like it has a solid ground to begin with a really, really good story that is going to keep you hooked. So my review for you guys is 7.8 for the first episode. Well, let's say an 8. An 8 for the first episode. I really liked it and I enjoyed it. I think you guys should check it out.